not everybody did, of course. It's a lot of people that made top eight, so, um, you know, naturally over time. So, yeah. Uh, just setting things up now. Okay, and the first match we'll be streaming is Pools Round 3. Kerbo Wodo versus Trainer Red G, not Player 2, obviously. Alright, and I believe we're good to start. Alright. Good luck to both players here. It looks like we're getting the Palu versus a Terry. Got some lag to start off here. I imagine we'll get we might get a lag test here. Maybe not. Oh goodness. Alright, I'll try to ignore the lag here. Alright, so first stalker obviously of game one. So nothing nothing crazy has happened yet in terms of the storylines. But uh, I mean not even into the game is a kill right off from uh Kerbo Wodo there. With this side be off to the right side. And now Go Meter is online for Kerbo Wodo. Kind of scary. But uh, they are also sitting at uh, 117. So, going to die pretty soon. Oh, and an unfortunate SD there from uh, Trainer Red G. I mean, honestly, for both players, this lag is pretty rough. Oh, but Kerbo Wodo is just kind of pushing through here with some really nice chain there, going to 54%. The Nair from Red will not kill, but the back here definitely will off the left side. The constant up airs from Red. Which is understandable. Pal's one of Pal's best moves. Wow, what is going on here with the internet? And it goes for the forward smash, misses it as uh, Red kind of dies out of it and air dodges. Looking kind of dangerous here for Red, sitting at 108 on last stock, and especially with uh, Kerbo having go meter, but it doesn't matter as now they don't. Kerbo does not have go meter anymore on the last stock, so with the capabilities that Palu has, I mean, it's totally not out of the question here for, for, uh, for Red. Oh, but the side B is going to do it. I imagine, there's no way we don't get a lag test here. Uh, this, that, was, that was pretty rough, I will say. But Trainer Red G does get the first point, regardless of lag. You know, one second here. to check something. Okay, never mind. We're going right into the game. Alright. They're not even live testing. They're kind of 
They're kind of going for it. All right. Red now has set point as uh, pool is his best of three. Kind of scary here. Oh, sorry. Uh, oh, yeah, red. Red. Wait. What am I? Red does not have point. That is totally my bad. That would be Kerbo would have. Kerbo has the first point. That is my bad. Alright, so Kerbo has a set point here. Sorry for that uh, miscommunication. Kerbo has a set point as his pool's best of three. And starting off the game here, it's uh, pretty even still. But Red is starting to maybe get a lead with some nares and up airs. There, there in the center stage in the back you're off the platform and now go meter is online Buster Wolf will definitely kill off the left side a back air off either side would probably do it at this point or an up smash that would definitely do the trick there And now it's back to a essentially even game, although Kerbo just gets a 34% combo there. Make sure he, they stay on top. Oh, even again with some uh, up air chains from Trainer Red G. Okay, side B off the right side there. Oh, misses the up smash off the, le the ledge get up. Oh, barely misses the side B there. Unfortunate for Red. Uh, could get it here, though. Nope. Kerbo jumps over it and knows what they're looking for. Uh, Red catches them with a nair. Oh, up smash nearly misses uh, Kerbo there. Definitely would have killed, I think, at this percent. And now Go Meter is online. The stock will likely get taken. I don't know how the Forest Smash missed there from Red, actually. But it did. And the dash attack from Kerbal will actually take it right there. It's looking kind of scary for Red right now as Kerbal does have Go Meter. And not really super close to death or anything. Terry is heavier than most people will give him credit. Oh, misses the buff, uh, Buster Wolf there. Right as you're searching for that back air or a nair out the left side. As either would do the trick, probably. Nice shield from Red. Back air throw might do it. Not quite. Good DI from uh, Kerbo. Oh, the footstool from Red will do the trick there. Sometimes it's the least expected thing that does the best trick. Especially in Smash. But Kerbo already had something started before they even lost the first stock. And the power dunk will probably take it. Oh! I think that was a really good DI from uh, Red there, but it wasn't enough. And Kerbo takes the set. With 2-0. Oh, never mind. It is best of three. I am a hooligan. Good thing this is our test stream. <laughs> or our test set, I should say. I'm totally out of it right now. Alright, I expect Red is going to be counterpicking maybe a, even a character here. Yeah, Incineroar actually. Two fighters, I respect it. 
and potentially could do the trick. Everybody knows what they're doing. Oh, Kerbo misses the spike hitbox there. I'm really unfortunate. But it doesn't really matter as they are racking up a lot of damage as we start here. Oh, nice Alolan whip there. Oh, revenge! It's scary. Oh, that would kill if they had gotten the right timing, but they did not. Unfortunate for Red, that would definitely would have killed at that percent and at that position. Let's back up the left side from Red. This is the Alolan Whip. It's kind of scary percent, for, really for Kerbo actually. But now the Kerbo has a go meter, it actually isn't that scary as now they have the comeback mechanic online. Oh, the Power Wave will actually kill there. I'm actually surprised, being since Cinnor being as heavy as they are and. You know, kind of whack. For it off the right, though. It looks like Red might not allow him to get any extra credit, and he actually doesn't. It is now even percents here, starting to get, uh, stock two off. Kerbo is coming back, but then as just as they see that Red actually gets revenge off, side B would actually kill not center stage though. Go meter is online. Up smash off the left will kill. And Cinnor is very heavy. It'd be surprising to see uh Kerbo actually get this stock. Oh well, there it is. Off the right side of the back air will do it. Red getting some up airs in there. Nice 25% on there. All revenge is online. Alolan. Oh, Alolan Whip does not kill at 60 center stage. But now, at, sitting at 110, Kerbo is. I mean, it's looking kind of scary here. Revenge again online. Probably any hit would do it. Not forward or center stage. Really unfortunate positioning here from Red. But all they really need now is one decent move. Even without Revenge would do the trick. Sweet Spot Fair would probably do it. Or an air as well. Oh, good DI from uh, Kerbal there. Misses the Alolan Whip. It's getting kind of scary, actually, for Red. Oh my gosh, the Power Wave twice in one game will actually kill. And that is the set. Kerbo Wudo with a 3-0 over Trainer Red G.